Hey, it's Lynette Chandler from TechBaseMarketing.com. All right, sometimes you may find yourself having to upgrade a WordPress plugin manually. So I know you, that you see on your screen here that uh, I have an upgrade available that I can click update now. But assuming that this automatic process is not working, I'm going to show you how to upgrade a WordPress plugin using FTP method. So uh, in this video, I'm going to assume that you know how to operate a FTP program and you know how to log into your website uh, using FTP. So before we go ahead and do any kind of FTP, the first thing we need to do, and as you see here, I brought up my Filezilla, which is my FTP program of choice. And the first thing you need to do is make sure that you have downloaded the plugin from the developer or WordPress.org or wherever you get this plugin from. And make sure you download it to your computer, as I have here, and unzip it. And most plugins, when you unzip it, it will be unzipped into a folder like I have here. So now that we've done that part, we're going to go ahead and log into our website and I'm going to pause the video here while I log into my website via FTP and now that I've logged into my website I need to make sure that I uh, navigate to the WP content folder which is this one and you can either click on it on the top panel uh, to open it or if you see in the bottom panel you can you need to double click it and then uh, we need to go look for the plugins folder which you see here and double click it now a lot of people at this point would just simply uh, upload the plugin folder directly over and let the FTP software override it and you can do that there's certainly nothing wrong with that but uh, I like to be sure that I have a brand new plugin in there so what I prefer actually to do is look for the plugin folder name which I have here and it's matching on both sides and I'm gonna delete that first now, it's not gonna delete your content or anything like that when you do it by FTP and now that it's done I will go ahead and upload it into this plugins folder. Depending on the size of your plugin, it may take a minute or two. And now that I've seen it's done, and let me go check that it is indeed in here. All right, great. So I know that it's finished uploading. Let me go back to our uh, website here and refresh our active plugins page. And you see it has been updated to the latest version. So I'm glad, I hope this has been helpful. And if you need more content like this, uh, come visit me at techbasemarketing.com. Uh, I have lots of uh, technical content and um, content about how to merge your business with technology and stuff like that on my blog. And I hope to see you there.